What's going on, everybody? I'm back with another video. It's TPNL. I know it's been a while. I've uh, been tired of been busy. I'm not going to make any excuses. But if you're new, subscribe, turn your notifications on. Uh, you don't want to miss some upcoming videos. i got some brand deals coming up. It's going to be a great opportunity for you to save on some, some things. I don't want to give away too much, but it's coming soon. So have your notifications on so you don't miss anything. This video right here is not a brand deal. I got a package from Sticker Fab. It's about four items. I'm going to run you all through the list. Some door seals. And I'm going to tell you why I got the door seals. Uh, we got a sun visor warning overlays. And those are for these uh, ugly overlay signs. So when you put the thing down, it's just, it's just hideous. So I got something to throw over top of that. Um, we did printed series, lower steering wheel, uh, spoke overlay. So that's something for right here. Uh, I'm going to do close-ups of all of these things. And smoke side marker overlays. We smoked the taillights out already. I've been loving them. I enjoy them. Some people don't like them. They say it makes the car like look too bulky or like a... a remote control car or like a uh, some kind of toy but I don't think so it's all in your head it looks phenomenal I've been getting compliments on the smoke tail lights from other people that I run into that have Broncos and they also love oh I can't tell y'all about that because I, I didn't put that out yet but that's coming soon too um, so let's get into the video appreciate y'all rocking with me um, we're gonna start with the overlay for the steering wheel and that should be quick and easy let's roll all right so here's the steering wheel but I just want to tell y'all before we get started Everything that we are laying down today, I have already went through and wiped it down. Um, some people use alcohol, I just use some Clorox wipes, and then I made sure it was dry and went over it with a clean cloth. So you have the steering wheel right here. We're gonna be placing the sticker overlay right here. They sent me two of these joints, so that was like nice of them. So you can see it right here. I think I got it centered for you all. Bow, right there. And I'm gonna take one off. Making sure that's the area for it. Yeah, it looks good. All right, so let's see what we're working with. And then I'll give you guys a close up as well. Hopefully I can knock this out on the first try. I'm not like the most, or the best sticker person. I have huge hands. So it makes things a little bit more difficult. Um, but I think I did a good job. Look at that. Somebody sent me a link. I want to black out the, um, the actual Bronco emblem on the wheel. But that looks good. Quick and easy, guys. Boom. Looks better than the original already. I know it does. I know it does. All right, I don't know how good the angle is right here because I have the roof open and the sun's uh, shooting. But they sent me two of each of these also. So I have, like, replacements. This is one, and this is the other. Um, two stickers here, one sticker here. So... Here you have it, two and one, boom, boom. Um, I already, like I said before, have wiped these down and have cleaned them, that is important. I wouldn't put anything on a dirty surface. So the surface is clean with all that being said. So let's get that peel off going. Oh my goodness, the challenge of a peel off. Jiminy Cricket, there it is, we got it. We got her, we got her. The wind is blowing, so just wanna make sure uh-oh. Uh-oh. Come on, Win. Shooting a video here. Mm -mm. A little line in there. It's not too bad. Uh-oh. That looks better already. If I'm having trouble with the itty-bitty small one, then goodness gracious one down since the wind's blowing this way I'm gonna layer like so the wind over here like I got other plans <laughs> that looks good Stop beeping the horn. I can get these bubbles. <laughs> Sorry about the airplane. You know how I go in the videos. That looks so much better already. All right, we're in on the other side. Let's see if it helps me being able to sit down in the car and knock it out. Shit. Might be even harder. It's 
Sorry if I'm blocking the vi view. I actually did a worse job on this one. <laughs> but I'm gonna straighten it out. That looks so much better. A couple bubbles in there, but all I had to do is stretch it on out. Give y'all a close up. Here you get a close up right here. You can see a couple little bubbles in here. I'm probably gonna like try to rub those out or poke it with a pen. Like, see that one just came up easy peasy. So I'm gonna just mess with it a little bit more, but I'm not gonna do it this whole video. And then on this one, you see a few as well. And then, um, but it looks way better than having those big old white signs up there. Let me show y'all from the outside. I don't know how bad this reflection is, but you can totally see those white signs just look a lot better with the covers on them. Look at that, you can't even tell. So the bubbles just might be me in the inside, but who's gonna get in the car and be like, hey man, what are those bubble things on your car? Uh, not many people. All right, we're moving on to the door seals. Um, boom, one, two, three, four, two big ones, uh, two short ones. And once again, I have already wiped all of this down cleaned all four sides up um you see the three uh red strips that needs to be peeled off that's basically 3m tape um it's really uh important because people getting in and out of your car could potentially slip um it can be you see some kind of scratches building up here so it's just to kind of protect the car let me see if i can show y'all something else you can even see on this side of the car right here you can even see like the scratch that's from me putting the doors back on uh it happens i've seen people with broncos do worse damage but nobody's really gonna be able to see that even with the doors all the way off like that's not too big of a deal for me personally but just to have that protected there people climbing out um the grip won't be able to slip won't be scratching it up shoes heels whatever uh it's something i've been wanting to put on the vehicle all right so i'm just placing them on here right now to make sure i put them on the right side um I don't think this is the right side because it's hanging off a little bit more. Okay, oh, look at that, it has an L. So this is for the, you see the L right here? That's for L, for the left side, and the other one's for the right side of the vehicle. So that's cool. But what I don't understand is why this one has three and this one has two uh, 3M strips. All of them came with, with three 3M strips. Three 3M strips, and here goes another one with, oh snap, stuff's flying car. another with 3M strip. Oh snap, that's fine, my car. I'll get it at my earliest convenience, I promise. Um, so this is the left side, which is the left side of the vehicle. So that makes a lot more sense and looks good. So that'll sit just like so. So let's peel these strips off and lay them down. Sorry for the yelling in the back. Kids riding bicycles. You can see what's cooking, boom. And we're gonna place her on. Get one shot. All right, make sure I push it down. Really good. Um, get that good stick. Like I said, all of them came with three except for one. That must have been a little bit of a mishap. But it's all good. So we're gonna just knock out the left side first and then move on to the back and with the 3m stick i would give it like 24 hours so i wouldn't like try to step on it or do anything crazy but like 24 to 48 hours let it stick especially i think i'd be good after 24 especially being in this south florida heat but it looks good that's the first one down check it out looks really good don't worry about the inside of the car it's a little dirty in here all right here we are on the left back side i'm just placing this down and uh, I don't like that one. Uh oh. Let me get that back. All right. Boom. <clears throat> Push it down. Make sure we got a good stick. And the good thing about it, like if this ever comes up, like you could buy a 3M tape from a Walgreens or a CVS. It's no biggie. Probably even better 3M tape, to be honest. And then make it do what it do yourself. It's not lifting off. Make sure the door's closed fine. No problem. 
open up. Still looking good in front and back. Let's get the other side. I'll show y'all the end results. Here we are on the other side. This is the rear passenger door. This is the rear driver's door or front door. Boom, look good. Kind of matches the step a little bit. I like it. Picasso. Distant love. love. Looking good. All right, now we're over to the smoked side marker overlay, which is this part of the car right here. I already wiped it down. Make sure you wipe it down. Make sure it's dry, make sure it's clean. And then with these, they got the D and the P. So I'm guessing that's driver's side and passenger side, hopefully. Looks about right. I like to wet these a little bit and put a little bit of soap in the water, just a little bit. And then I smooth it down. And then um, for my Floridians out here, I got me a Duffy's card to get the bubbles out. Hold on, hold on. Y'all might try to steal my stuff. Boom. I don't even know if some stuff y'all on there on there that y'all can steal, but still. Got my cup of water with a little bit of soap in there. A little bit of soap. Un poquito for my Spanish-speaking folks out there. <laughs> Wet this thing down a little bit. Wet her up a little bit. She a little wet. Boom. Slide it right on there. That looked really good. Whoa. Let's keep on going. Boom. Got a little bubble right there. Got no bubble right there. Got that. I got that bubble out quick. This might be my best lay ever. No punt. Nice and easy. I do not want to rip it. They did not send me two of these. And uh, just want to stretch it. And then the extra, I want to fold it around. Even on the back end. Mm -hmm. Got one little bubble right here that I'm kind of working out. It's looking good to me. You see a little bubble at the top? I'm going to work that out. A lot of times this will go away too as it dries. As that water dries under it, that'll just go away. Even like when you first get like your car tinted, sometimes you see those bubbles and they just vanish. Once that water dries under it, it'll be out of there. That looks good. All right, I already wet her up, not too much. Peeling her off here. It's a windy day, so I gotta be careful. Boom. Whoa, 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 whoa. All right. Damn, that might've been better than the first one. Look at that. Boom, folder, folder. Oh, how you doing? <laughs> no, nah, putting a uh, overlay on the um, like a, a blacked oh, out yeah, overlay yeah. on it, oh, yeah. <laughs> and then rubbing the bu bubbles out. Oh. I like these bubbles. It's my baby, man. All right, so we just rubbing this thing. I got a couple bubbles, which I think will go away once um, the water under it dries. I didn't. My my thumb started bleeding a little bit under here. I was rubbing it so much. Um, but it looks good. It looks good overall. Tell me what y'all think in the comment section. Um, I think that's everything, guys. I think that's everything. So shout out to Sticker Fab. Y'all hit me up if y'all want to collaborate or work in the future. Any other brands, anybody else got anything going on? Appreciate y'all rocking with me. Hope y'all enjoy. Can't wait to get this thing on the road. New videos coming soon. I'm out. Click on some of the greatness that's popping up on your screen.